Okay, so what we're looking at is the internal anatomy of the crab, again, anterior, posterior. Once we've removed the carapace here, uh, what we can see inside uh, of this male crab is the hepatopancreas, all this digestive gland right here. We can also see the stomach right here, so that's this structure. Uh, this is the cardiac stomach. And then if you can see down here, there's this little tiny tube, that is the midgut. And on top of that midgut is this structure, or was this structure, I lifted it up. And this is your heart, super, super simple uh, heart. And it has some ostea on it, so if I get kind of close up, might be a little hard to see, but there's some tiny little ostea. So the ostea are the holes that are in the heart that allows for the uh, fluid to move around, okay? So again, that's that right here. Because this is a male, it has some testes here that are going to deliver the sperm to the structure we had talked about earlier, uh, these copulatory structures right here. And the midgut attaches to the hindgut right here or the intestine before it goes out the anus. Uh, just lateral to the uh, digestive system are the respiratory system, which is where respiration is going to occur. These are the gills, and this structure right here is considered a gill raker. So there's one on each side of the crab because they are bilaterally symmetrical. And that's it.